grand risings, y'all. Supreme, supreme, heavenly rises. I have such a great, great, big, big message for y'all today, especially chosen ones, okay? And I know y'all are hearing all this stuff about chosen ones. Well, God has put through me, put into me a very important message for you today. And I am so humbled and in great gratitude, I accept this honor, Heavenly Father, that I am destined and, 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 and appointed through you with my anointing to give this message to all my fellow brothers and sisters that are chosen. I'm here to tell you today who you really are in being a chosen one because so many people are talking about this, but they ain't telling you everything. So I'm going to, it's going to get a little bit lengthy, but listen, I know you ain't going to be bored when I start telling you this stuff. Matter of fact, it might run into part two, but don't you miss part two if it does go into that. We about to go ham. We going to, we finna get deep, deepity deep, deep into this chosen business. Now, many of you know your signs and attributes and being chosen as being someone who has gone through great, great suffering. You, since you were a child, have had trauma. You've been under spiritual attack since birth, baby. The, Satan been trying to take you out. Him and his minions been trying to take us all out. And, and, and the reason is you are destined for greatness. And I'm about to tell you exactly what that greatness is. It's going to be so mind-blowing, some of you going to get chills. I'm talking about some serious chills when I tell you and reveal to you what I know. Ooh, it's getting me so excited that I got to, oh, I'm getting ready to tell you. Okay, so let me calm down. Okay, so let's start here with this. Okay, imagine this is your cell phone, okay? You know that TV show they call the Black Mirror? Okay, Black Mirror is what they use for scrying. This is what today's modern crystal ball. Yeah, we all been using it. I know now you feel like, oh my God, I've been using it. Oh my God, we're not supposed to mess with that stuff. This is your laptop. This is your TV, just bigger. This is your gaming thing. This, in the spirit world, like you're looking at me right now through your black mirror, you see me inverted. You see me in reverse because that's how the spirit world looks through and they see us in this realm you understand so all these people that are telling you and i know some of you have heard this some of you haven't so i'm about to reveal some stuff to you get ready hold on to your drawers hold on to your drawers they're telling you if you bear this mark in your hands you see what i'm showing you the m's everybody calling them m and m's if you bear these marks in your palms the two m's you are indeed a chosen one by god himself he has marked you with his holy mark. You are his holy one that he has chosen. And it's not just chosen. I'm about to let me, wait, hold on, hold on. Get ready for it, get ready for it. In the black mirror, everything's reversed, remember? So the, the M's look like they're going outward, right? See how they're going outward? But when you turn them in in yourself, you see them pointing inward. But inversion is also this way, this way. So look at them this way. What does that say? A W. You know what the W is for? Holy Watcher. Yeah. You a holy watcher. So am I. The watchers are what? They're God's holy angels. Holy angels. You're not the fallen angels. We are God's chosen watchers sent down here with a purposeful mission that is being revealed to you today. Yes. We are God's holy watchers. I love her. Isn't she cute? She's holding the trumpet. She's blowing. The trumpet's blowing, y'all. It's blowing. It's blowing. We the watchers. We are God's chosen holy watchers appointed for such a time as this. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Father. It's a, ooh, ooh, it's, it's going up and down my spine. It's going up and down my spine. I'm so thankful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, somebody talk to me now. Put something in the comments that you you understand what I'm talking about. That God is talking to you. You chosen. You got, don't be afraid of it. And don't be thinking you can't talk about being chosen because they watching you. Of course they watching you. They know who we are since birth. In every hospital you've been to, doctor's appointment, they draw on blood. They mess with your teeth in the dentist's office. They got your DNA. You think they don't? You think they don't know your bloodline? You don't even know your bloodline, some of you. Now we come to the next part. If this is going to take some time, about five minutes, let me hurry up. Okay, so Jesus, 
Now remember Putin revealed not too long ago that he is black. Yahushua Mashiach was black. They ain't never want, can you, can you imagine they want the whole world calling him that African name? White folks ain't never was gonna have it. And don't think I'm prejudiced, how could I be? My bloodline been mixed over years of slavery and ancestry and all that. All of us are mixed, I ain't prejudiced. But I'm just speaking facts. Black nobility is where the bloodline comes from. If you're RH native, you have the same bloodline as Yehoshua Mashiach. Yeah, a lot of white folk might get upset at me saying this, but guess what? For years, those British fake royals been saying that they, watch Da Vinci Code, they claim to come from Jesus' bloodline, right? The holy bloodline, the RH negative bloodline, Mary Magdalene, all that stuff, and the movie Angels and Demons, and they putting on that big old masquerade, sitting in the seat of Jacob's stone underneath the queen's seat all these years. What was she doing with that stone? All that stuff stolen. The identity stealers, just like, <coughs> excuse me, them ones over there, Revelation 2 9, God said, I know who they are, they claim they are. The true Jews, Jewish. They not, they Jewish, that means like a Jew. But he's, God said, I know who they are, but they not, they the synagogue of you know what. Revelations 2, 9. They the same people that claim to be that black nobility, the, the nobility, the royal family in England. They ain't no royal, they, they got all that from the Moors. The Moors at one point in time conquered Italy. They conquered Spain. The black nobility was all throughout Europe. And even that Celtic stuff over there in Ireland, they was black too. That's why the women, that are, the Irish hair, that red hair with the freckles, that's melanin. They evolved from being black. I know people don't, they feel that this might sound racist, but that's where it came from. Ain't no 15%, the Basque of Spain have RH negative. Listen, that bloodline is holy and it came from Yahushua and Mashiach. If you are RH negative, you share his bloodline. There's holy angels that have been sitting down here in human form to do what you're doing right now, the purpose you have being chosen. And then there's demonic RH negative bloodline that came through the fallen angels. And then they created Nephilim and they carry something on that blood that we don't have, which is a D antigen. D for demonic, D for devil, D for demon, presidents, all them celebrities that got it. The people in England claiming to be the royals, they all claim the same bloodline. But they don't breed with nobody else. You ever thought that was strange? They won't mix with no one else. They don't. They guard it with their life. They interbreed with their own brothers and sisters because they don't want nobody else finding out about that D antigen and how they differ with hybridization than the true people of Yah who are the ORH negatives. And you can't tell me, all oh, my whole family, we black. I might be light skinned, but don't don't let the light skin fool you. My daddy was black. I got light skin and dark skin in my family that range from white all the way to Wesley Snipes color. I got family all over in the Caribbean and down south Florida, Gullah Gullah, Seminoles and all that. Listen, we all owe next. My children owe next. We got all of us. We got the M's. They ain't no M's. They W's. We watchers. And so are you. Come into knowing who you are. I got so much information on this, but I want you to understand you are special. And I know there's a lot of black people out there. You need to get and find out your bloodline. They're not telling everybody for the simple fact that they know it's very affluent among black people. It's all throughout Africa, O negative and O positive. But O positive is not the same as having the D antigen. That's why they keep telling everyone we're O negs, but they're not the O negs. They know the chosen blood. Imagine this. Jesus' blood was ransomed from many and poured out to save souls. In other words, he gave it to everybody to save your life. O negatives can only give to everybody, just like Yahushua. But you can only receive from the same type of people. You are a holy watcher. We're angels, y'all. We're angels. Accept your position and know that you're going to go through some trials and tribulations. Baba Vanga spoke about it. Look her up and find the five keys. I wrote them all down. She has five keys. I can't get into it. The video is about to end. But you are destined for greatness. You're a warrior. You're going to fight them spiritual battles. You're about to evolve. That's what the shift is all about. It's you. I love you, Holy Angel. I hope you take this news and roll with it. Be blessed and anointed. Mwah. I love you. Thank you so much for listening. And thank you, Heavenly Father, for me being appointed to give this news. 
Oh, glory and honor is mine. I love you. Thank